folks, my name is Mike. I am with I-80 Equipment. Today I'm going to show you a 2003 Freightliner FL-70. It's got a Digger Derrick by T-Rex Commander 4045. I'm going to show you that Digger and all of its features. First thing you want to do is climb up in the vehicle. You want to roll the ignition forward. <laughs> After you roll the ignition forward, you want to make sure it cycles through, being as it is a diesel. You go ahead and start that up. You want to ensure that your parking brake, trailer brakes are set, pulled. You want to make sure that you are in neutral before engaging any PTO. Right above the driver's compartment, we have a row of levers, or toggle switches, I'm sorry. We have your PTO, strobe, beacon, Work lights, compartment lights. Over here we have flood and spotlight, which is actually located right outside that A-pillar. If you see out there in the mirror, that's your spot, and then flood action. Spot's a little finer beam. has been DOT tested and proved. Good for one year. Does have outriggers. Driver side outrigger levers are here. Front and rear. Passenger sides are here. Front and rear. Tool circuit. Winch high low range. Captain bed wench controls. The captain located here. We have the stop run switch here. When you run, it'll only go in counterclockwise position. To reel it in, press it in that direction. And at this time, I'll go ahead and drop your outriggers. Starting with. Driver's side. We're make sure the outriggers are nice and firm on the ground. We have a rack stand here, or we have stairs to come up here. <coughs> this lever here will hydraulically raise and lower the vehicle while releasing the pen here, or the, the, the table. We have your digger dig. We have your winch control here. Tilt up and down for the pull cloth, open and close. Rotation, clockwise, counterclockwise of the entire boom. Up and down. Second stage in and out. Third stage in and out. Release for the whole entire console. And we have your release button here for the auger. We have your throttle control. High. Low. So a high idle on low, and then super high idle, and we have your start stop. Press and release, and hold. Inside here we have your bed winch, connected to your capstan. In order to engage your winch, you have a disengage and engage handle in the back of the bed. So at this time, I'll go ahead and fly it, show you that it digs.
Stop, stop. See in the back of the bed, your winch is not engaging. So you press your lever in, then it engages. Pull your lever back out, it free wheels the way. And with that to stop, nothing will run at all. Back down to standard control. Put your console away. Release your handle. Automatically raises hydraulically. Rotates all the way around. You can use it in any position you like, whatever sees this and comfortable for you. Locks in place. Press back down it, so it kind of holds hydraulic pressure down against it. At this time, we'll go ahead and raise your outrigger. Very easy, simple unit to use. We'll make sure your outriggers are all the way up prior to driving. If you don't have them all the way up, you could hit them on something while driving and cause damage to them. So you want to ensure that they are all the way up. Once they're all the way up, we'll go ahead and shut the vehicle down once you're all done. Alrighty. If you have your lights on, turn those off. If you have your hazards on, turn those off. Turn your PTO, your strobes, your beacons off. If you have your work lights, compartments of Phoenix on, make sure those are shut off also. Also your flood lamp, make sure that's turned off. And then go ahead and turn off your engine. Obviously if you're leaving the job site, leave it on to drive. What we do have is a T-Rex 4000 series commander manual for you. Sorry about the condition of it, how we got it from the auction. Driver's manual for a FL70 Freightliner. We have the driver's side steer tire, driver's side engine compartment, passenger side steer tire, passenger engine compartment. Of course, inside there we do have all fresh fluids and filters. This is your spot slash your spot flood. Inside of your compartments here. Capsin goes through the door as you see, plus you have your drawers underneath. Plenty of room, plenty of storage. Couple more drawers right above the passenger tires. And we have the drive tires, inner and outer. Tops of the bed, sides of the boxes, tops of the boxes, even the high pedestal itself have all been spray on bed lined. Tough, durable stuff. Plenty of storage. Inside of your first compartment, I do have a pair of wheel chocks, fire extinguisher, and a set of triangles for you. Thank you for purchasing from I-80 Equipment. Enjoy your vehicle.